Can't you move a house by yourself like wait? Like you move it from one place to another. So you take the microwaves in there and you take the different chairs and different things, all your clothes out there, right? And what is the time to start moving your sofa, the refrigerator, different things of that nature, right? So you can get it done, but ain't it easy better? You see what I'm saying? Let's switch that. Let's go to sex. You can play with it. You can make yourself feel good too, can't you, girl? Brother, play with it and yeah, feel good, right? Uh, but don't it feel better when somebody else touching you? Don't it feel better when somebody else playing with that? Don't it? You can go by yourself and hit yourself with that. Mm, here it come. And you can go with yourself, girl, and be like, oh, oh. But don't it feel better when you with him and you ride him and he say, go ahead. This one on you, put it right where you want to, do what you want to do. Don't it feel good, girl, when you say, go ahead, lift my legs up right here. Put it like this, do it. Don't it feel good? So I'm talking about the situations and moving and sexual situations all the way to relationships. Don't it feel better when you have somebody involved with you? Don't that feel better? So see, you can move this house and you can have this sex, but don't it feel better when somebody's with you? Drive down the street and hold your own hand. It's impossible, right? You can go to the movies by yourself, right? But don't it feel good when you do it? Don't you look in the morning and say you love yourself? How much more does it feel? How better does it feel when somebody else saying, I love you, girl. I love you, boy. So see, what I'm talking about now is relationships. It's good to love yourself. And I want you to understand that relationships are, are not always easy smooth through we meet and just hit the even those people that you come out and you see guess what they have issues by themselves they have issues in the house but the thing is it to work through it guess what together you see what i'm saying so it's a lot of things that you can do by yourself in relationships right the thing is the best relationships are the two people these are the soulmates that i believe are the best soulmates to when you make your souls compatible and touch together you see what I'm saying? When you help one another through trials and tribulations and you make it through together and you still feel good after that. Like the uh, scripture state, I told a friend of mine the other day, you never let the sun sit with you in a provoked state. Relationships are not always supposed to be easy. Say Abraham, Abraham and Sarah had problems. Isaac and his wife, Rachel, had problems. Jacob and, and, and his wife had problems. You see what I'm saying? But the thing is, they made it through it together and guess what they are now? history you see what i'm saying so it always coming when you having a problem in a relationship work it out talk about it move that sofa together you know what i'm saying move that sofa together touch him hey bro touch her tell each other i love you you know what i'm saying don't let the sunset between a provoked state work together to make you happy